गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड फिट ड्यू टू कोरोना वी हैव टू फेस मैनी प्रॉब्लम आई नो वेरी वेल ड्यू टू दैट रीजन जस्ट वी हैव टू गो विथ दिस ऑनलाइन सेशन बट वी हैव एन थनी अनदर ऑप्शन सो वी हैव टू गो विथ दिस ऑप्शन नाउ आई हैव यू बिकम यूज टू बाय ऑल दिस थिंग्स so can we continue our next computer science lecture already in last session i had given explanation regarding dbms now today i would like to give in um, information about dbms concepts i mean to say what is fox flow there are so many programs uh, by using we can create the database but uh, now from today just we have to go with only fox flow that is in your syllabus that's why we have to get further knowledge about this fox flow right okay now what is fox flow a fox flow is a product of microsoft corporation and uh, that's why it is also known as ms fox pro a fox pro is a package a fox pro is a database management software and build complex real life application uh, there are two type of fox pro which we can see over there that uh, one is a dos based fox pro and second one is a windows based fox pro a fox pro is also provides facility of programming fox pro offers facility of report writing level generate screen layout format menu driving driving facility and full support multi user application fox pro have wizard based working facility in 1980s fox pro was dbms it means database management system software developed by fox software in corporation Fox Pro offers all the features of a programming language and relational database management system. So, Fox Pro is also called RDBMS database. A DBMS is a set tools that help in managing information stored in a database. you are aware with what is the meaning of database i had given explanation in last session that's why i don't think so there is any problem in database fox pro is a relational database management system the term relational means relationships can be established between multiple tables of related data there are so many models uh, uh, in, which, which we can see in our database management system uh, that is hierarchical model network model and relational model but fox pro is depend on and ms access also it's uh, it is on based on a relational database management system this relational models model was developed by dr e f cord right okay next term is the fox pro is used to develop real application for in bank trading railway school college management billing stock maintenance accounting package etc fox pro is one of the popular database across the world that's why we can say that now there are so many versions of fox pro Uh, already we uh, discuss about it but um, right now i want to repeat this dbase 2 dbase 3 dbase 3 plus dbase 4 fox base fox pro 2.5 for dos fox pro 2.6 for dos and fox pro 2.6 for windows according to our syllabus just we have to go with this version fox pro 9 for windows visual fox pro including visual studio now there are different type of files which we can see in fox pro now i i, I would like to give uh, uh, information regarding this types of files 
in the database to store any data or information and different types of files dbms is used in foxflow there are different types of files according to foxflow or according to database we can say that according database fill uh, sorry uh, data and information both are different according to our knowledge data and information it means details but according to foxflow or any of the database management software these both terms are the meaning of both these terms are totally different data means you can compare this data with raw material and information with processed goods right what is the difference between raw material and processed goods you are aware with that yeah okay let's continue there are different type of files which you can see in foxflow that is first one is a program file this file is used to write the different types foxflow program each file defined with its extension the extension of this file is dot prg next one is the database file in which file to store the important data or information it's called the database file this file has a dot dbf extension next one is the third one is a report file different type of files which you can see in foxflow first one is that for program file second one is the database file and now we have to move in the third file that is the report file when any information can be stored in report from form this file is mac if you want to store any information in the form of report at that time you will have to utilize this type of file the extension of this type of file is that dot f r x now next one is that label file when you give any information or data in label form then this file is mac the extension of this file is that dot l b x now next one is that index file when any information can be arranged on any specific code at that time indexing will be done this index file have a dot idx extension next one is the screen file our sixth type of file is that screen file this file is used to write screen layout window for using input data by user each file defined with its extension the extension of this file is dot s c r do not forget it this question will come definitely in examination so according to point of view of examination just do not forget uh, this um, questions and uh, you will have to remember each and every extension of this different file next one is the query file this file is used to write query with using select command each file defined with its extension the extension of this file is the dot q p r next one is the project file this file is used to develop a project of an application software with using old type of files each file defined with its extension the extension of this file is that dot p r g next one is the memory file this file is used to save memory variable in the disk each file defined with its extension the extension of this file is the dot m e m last but not least menu file this file is used to create menu driving facility the extension of this file is dot m n x now i would like to give explanation regarding concept of database related words 
फर्स्ट वन इज एर डाटा द इंफॉर्मेशन विच इज गिवन और इनपुट टू द कॉम्प्यूटर इज कॉल्ड द डाटा डेटा वर्ड डिराइव फ्रॉम डाटम लैटिन लैंग्वेज एनी कैरेक्टर नंबर पिक्चर वॉइस एटसेट्रा आर डाटा द मीनिंग ऑफ डाटा इज नॉट प्रॉपर बट यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड वॉट आई मीन टू से suppose take 50 number but this number is what just play that we can't say like this number may be age marks or rupees rupees thus we can't directly understand the meaning of data in short we can say that we can compare uh, this data with raw material any information i mean to say any details regarding any person any place or any other things is known as data generally data cannot be used in its original form just we have to make some process on it and then we can utilize those particular data right our next term is that information we can compare this term with finished goods i told you na that data we can't utilize in its original form just we have to make some process on it and then after we collect any data is on the basis of that data is known as information so we can compare with this term with finished goods information and information is an arranged data to arrange a data as desired output then become an information after entering the data into the computer we can get the output it is called the information information is one kind of sorted data example the details of the cricketers are given i i would like to give you there are different details uh, of the cricketers uh, i i would like to give you first one number name of the cricketer and run number 1 sachin 150 run number 2 rahul 85 runs number 3 sehwag 118 number 4 yuvraj 55 number 5 saurav 13 these all details are only as a data but when we make some processing on it then it become information how many cricketers have made century if i am asking you on the basis of the data if to uh, if we gather any details that is information okay now first question is that how many cricketers have made century so you can say easily that sachin 150 and seva 180 right how many cricketers have made half century so you can easily say that rahul 85 and yuvraj 55 right how many cricketers have made minimum run so you can say that saurav 30 runs the details which are prepared depending on the answer of this questions are called the information is it clear everyone everyone what i mean to say okay so now we have to move on over another jump that is table every person store data to use in future we can store data in file books or computer we can see the data in computerized and non computerized both the forms right we can see it in both the forms collect all the details of the student as a form and then store it in 
file in our college you can see that when you uh, um, when do you want to get the admission in our college at that time first you will have to uh, fill up that admission form so on the basis of this admission form uh, your uh, information uh, must be prepared over there so uh, first of all we have to store that i mean to say all this info your, your information will be stored in computer uh, in the form of file we can store it into the computer by making the dbf file uh, or any another file right but right now just we have to go with this dbf jamal table the table displays is row and columns where column is a field and row as a record in uh, if i'm not wrong then then you are aware with excel right all the vertical lines of the excel worksheet is known as column and all the horizontal line of the worksheet is known as row but according to database all the vertical line of the table is known as field right in excel it is known as column but here it is known as field and all the horizontal line is known as record in excel it is known as row right okay so the example of table now just we have to see that already i had given it uh, sachin 130 rahul 150 sachin 150 rahul 85 sevag 180 yuraj 55 and saurav 30 this is the table we can say that we, if we write it in uh, with a uh, particular column there are three columns and uh, five uh, five records in your table you will have to give the heading for each and every columns so for numbering you will have to give their numbers for Uh, you know, name of the cricketers uh, second column and third one is that how many runs there that's why you will have to give that run the table makes combination of column and rows right in your excel you are aware with this what this terms columns and rows uh, in excel all the vertical line is known as column all the horizontal line is known as row the intersection of row and column is known as cell right here the table makes combination of columns and rows here table is used to store data into this permanently table is used for easy to retrieve required data quickly if you want to retrieve any of the data speedily at that time this table is very useful for you uh, so to create the database you need to create i mean to say you can create the database in the form of table always you can create the database in the form of table so now you are aware with the term of database what is database i don't think so that i have to give more explanation regarding this next one is there um yeah just i would like to give explanation regarding the components of dbms there are different type of components you are aware with it but then after i would like to give you right right now there are different type of components of dbms first one is the data different forms of values are known as data for example name city age etc above i mean to say this example how uh, i mean uh, if any example just i would like to give that in the name uh, column i i uh, if i write over the um parmar raj city rash court age 18 so this parmar raj rash court 18 are called data the data may be in character numbers picture sounds etc next one is the hardware i over with the definition of hardware the physical part of the computer like cpu monitor keyboard printer etc are not hardware we can also use the hardware to input or output the information into the database 
all the touchable parts of the computer is known as hardware in another words uh, all the parts of the computer which can be seen and touched are called hardware for example monitor cpu keyboard mouse etc there are so many another devices also but this is the primary and main device of the computer next one is there our next term is that software the program which acts for the necessarily of the hardware is called the software the software are used as a part of the dbms the software enables to add arrange delete data and get report the various softwares are available in the market there are various softwares are available in the market fox pro clipper dbase access oracle cbase ms sql database etc group of program is known as software all the part of computer which can be seen but cannot be touched are called software and next one is the project to perform the certain work application we must make various database is like write program make report write query label form etc are necessary to do work with database thus this collection of the different applications are known as a project to make an employee salary bill different type of files are necessary we need that table form report query label program module etc collection of this file is called the project in another terms of the database you can say that group i mean to say table uh, different objects like table report form queries macros modules all this group i mean to say group of these objects are known as database all these type of objects is known as database right and are uh, in last session i uh, i had given Uh, explanation regarding rdbms advantages of rdbms is also clear over the uh, characteristics of dbms you are aware with it use of dbms you are also aware with it data model different data model which we can utilize in uh, fox from uh, already hierarchical network and relational data model but this uh, i am uh, this fox from is based on relational data model so i would like to give uh, i am mean to say i would like to make discussion regarding only relational data base data model the relational data model after more than a decade has emerged from the research development test and trial stages as a commercial product this model has the advantage of being simple in principle users can express their queries in a powerful query language in this model the relation is the only construct required to represent the associations among the attributes of an entity as well as the relationships among different entities in this model user not need know to the exact physical structures to use database and are protected from 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 any changes made to this structures rows of the relation are referred to as tuples of the relation and column are its attributes each attributes of a relation has a distinct name the values for an attributes or a column are drawn from a set of values known as a domain a relation represented by a table having a, a column defined on the domains d1 d2 this is the example only is a subset of the 
Cartesian product, right? So, this is the relational model. I don't think so. There is any problem in this, all these things. Now, we have to move on our another term. You are aware with this field and record. When do you want to decide the name of field? At that time, you will have to follow some rules over there. We have to, some points will be taken into consideration at the time to give the name of field. The field name must be between 1 to 10 character. It means you can't give more than 10 character as a name of field. The name of the field, it must be start with the alphabets alphabetic volume as the rest of the character you can utilize over there alphabets and number both there right so but it is the necessary you will have to start your field name with any alphabetic value as the rest of the character you can apply that underscore numbers and alphabets we can utilize only punctuation mark or space in the field name. If you want to give the division in the name at that time only underscore sign can be utilized there. For example, if you want to give the GR number column filled at that time GR underscore number you can give there. Every time field name must be given in proper manner so we can easily identify it so appropriate name must be given for field name you can apply you can give the name uh, field name in any of the case uppercase or lowercase alphabet you can utilize over there Foxboro is not case sensitive language though so there is no any problem so uh, you can write the name of field in uppercase or lowercase according to your requirements but Foxro will consider both this case in same manner you cannot give the same name for two different field you will have to give each, uh, I mean to say, you will have to give the unique name, unique field name for each and every field. You cannot give the field name of any command name or file name, like any command name or file name. Uh, in another uh, words, you can say that uh, any command name or file name cannot be given as a name of field. Append, display, edit, all these commands of Foxpro. So you cannot give that any field name of, uh, I mean to say, append uh, as a field name append, right? Um, next one is there. I don't think so. There is, there is any point is remaining there. So do not forget all these points over there. When uh, this point should be taken into consideration to give the name of field, do not forget it. So to, today, I hope there is no any problem in this session. It's over here. Now take care of yourself and have a nice day. See you soon as early as possible.